Hello and welcome to the first installment of BMX WTF Reactions. I am your host, Big Man X. And as we all know, YouTube has given us hundreds and thousands of videos that has entertained us since the day it was created. Yet it has also given us just as many, maybe even more, really weird, really stupid, and just all around bad videos. SHUT IT! Anyway. This is a series where I show you the weirdest, dumbest, and worst of what I find on YouTube, as well as the videos that you submit into me if you do that. Please do it. And by the worst, I don't mean, like, worst quality. No, far from it. I mean, like, videos that are just full of nonsensical what-the-fuckery. But I do have my limits on what I can stand. I'm going to do videos that have actual effort put into it, and not videos that are just made for the purpose of just being on YouTube like this. What the fuck is even going on here? And granted, the limitations that I will have on what I can stand will most likely change lo the longer I do this. But, what I'm going to do in this video is I'll show you the video give you my basic reaction to the video, and then talk about it once it's concluded. Each episode will follow a theme or a topic, and it will be different depending on the episode. Unless I find a bunch of new videos under a previously done topic, then I do what I'd like to call a sequel episode. Now without further ado, let's get into this episode's topic, Hatsune Miku and MMD. Hatsune Miku is a popular Japanese pop artist over in Japan, and of course, her story was actually in her video games of all places. Go figure. Oh, and did I forget to mention that Hatsune Miku is entirely computer generated? That's right, nothing about this girl is authentic. Even her voice is computer generated by a program called Vocaloid. The Vocaloid program was used to make Hatsune Miku's voice as well as a few other singers. After their popularity grew, a program known as MMD or Miku Miku Dance was released to the public. The program allowed people to import the Vocaloid avatars and are able to animate them and make videos with them. In the right hands, people actually make some pretty cool videos. But for some reason, the MMD program seems to fall into the hands of people with the IQ of a lobotomized monkey and we get videos that would make the creators over in Japan commit seppuku! So, let's not wait any longer and get this over with. Oh, God, did that hurt. Sorry, but there is absolutely no way I could possibly watch this whole video just because of its beginning. I mean, what the hell is going on here? We're given an apocalyptic setting and Hatsune Miku is singing so fast that I doubt even the Japanese know what the fuck is being said. Give this girl some freaking Ritalin, for God's sake, because my insurance can't cover the constant brain explosion that this video keeps causing. Gah! Let's hope the next one is more calm. So, what is it? Alright, let's see what we have here. Ah! Why is his tea shining like that? Ah. And now he's going to some fancy footwork? And now we're almost non-existent boobs. Fascinating. I am back to her footwork. Oh dear god, it looks like she's staring into my soul! What the hell is that noise she's letting off? Oh my god, my brain hurts! And now we're dancing summons up fruits and vegetables! Fascinating, how? Oh my god, it looks like she wants to beat me to death with that juice in her hand! Oh, she was really vigorously shaking that thing, huh? Note to self, don't ask for a hand job from her. And that's her dancing now summons up. What the hell was that? Oh, and what? Even more come back? Okay, then her t t uh, jousting things. And oh my god, the pelvic thrust people again. What the hell? And now she's drowning in purple juice. Fascinating. Wait, is that my Taniyama from Ghost Hunt? I swear to God, that was her! 
And then she goes back to the fruits and vegetable summoning j a dance. Oh my god, the sun looks like it's scared as I am. What the hell is that? Atsune Miku, use kanji breath. What the hell is that? Then we got a mob of those guys doing that, and oh my god, what is up with this guy? And now she's dancing in bubbles. Fascinating. I think we almost got a panty shot there. What? Why? Why does my brain hurt? Ow. Why? Uh, why? What can I say about this? Well, the first thing I should point out is that this is actually a commercial for a Japanese variation of the V8 vegetable juice called, what else? Popipo. So because it's Japanese, we already know that headaches and other brain-related pain is in store for us with really weird visuals and all. The dancing is weird and is only complemented by the even weirder song, which is the theme for the drink. And apparently this song is good enough that it left the commercial and went into live performances. I, however, think that this sounds like the auto-tuned aborted love child of Alvin and the Chipmunks and LMFAO. Huh. Okay, that was actually... That actually wasn't that bad. But my point still stands! I'm still trying to figure out the purpose of these things. And, again, what is my Tanayama from Ghost Hunt doing here? What else can I say about this but it's weird as hell and full of nonsense but definitely got our attention? What's next? Okay. Cute. It sounds pretty cute. Wait, drums? Where did he come from? From? Wait, I think that's a guy. I hope it's a boy. That's definitely a girl, but what is up with the dance? It's all adorable, and then the drums become awesome and the guitar comes in? What? Okay, this is not a song that can be turned into a rock ballad. I mean, seriously, do these lyrics and this voice sound like it become rock? Come on, that is crazy! Wait, what? They're not doing anything. Oh, crap! We forgot our lines! What do we do next? Let's just stand here! Maybe they won't notice that we fucked up! Let's have the camera go all awesome! Get all these awesome camera shots! Maybe they will think it's still awesome! S seriously What? Oh my god! Those two just phased in from nowhere! Hey, wait! That's the nipple guy from Popipo! And then the two newcomers do nothing. Why did they suddenly freeze and okay now Hatsune Miku's the only one dancing? Why? I don't know. Okay, and does they become an iPod commercial? How? I don't know. That's a really good question though. How? Oh, guess they all forgot their lines again. Oh crap! What do we do next? Let's just do what we did previously! Have the camera pan away and have us all stand here like we don't know what we're doing! Hopefully they won't notice! What are you, an idiot? Of course they'll notice! Wait, that's it? Oh, come on! Bullshit! Wow. That was just full of... nothing. The animation, what little there really is, is a little sticky at times, but fluid nonetheless. Sort of. But there really isn't any. It's just one really short and really dumb dance routine put on a loop. And don't get me started on the song. This song was just so unbalanced, the vocals and lyrics sounded like they belonged in a Hello Kitty video game, while the instrumental music sounded like it was ripped away from a more awesome song. It was so mismatched that I thought at any moment someone or something was going to come in and disrupt this video, and right now there are only two things that I would allow. One, being that whatever it is comes and kills slash clobbers Hatsune Miku. And two, being it be Heavy Metal Jesus Christ riding the back of a fire-breathing dragon bunny being followed by hot-bikini-clad mud wrestlers while curing everyone of illness and impotency with the sheer awesomeness that is this moment! What? A guy can dream, can't he? But as you can see, nothing happened, literally, and there was no Heavy Metal Jesus. Let's hope the next video makes up for this one. Um... Okay... 
this is different. What is up with this music anyway? So, this music, they have, okay, you have Hatsune Miku singing, but then you have some random dude trying to make the sound all, I don't know, adorable, sweet? I don't know. How do you make this sweet? You have two girls feeding a cat girl an oversized bottle of milk! Look at the facial expressions this dude's putting into it! I swear to god, some sort of Japanese perv is getting off to this as we speak! This is creepy! This is weird! And the music doesn't help at all! She's in... What is... Who would even think of doing this? Why would you? Oh god, that's just a creepy look. This is a weird video. Those two girls are enjoying this way too much. I, I, I honestly don't know what to say about this. What the hell is going on here? You have two girls in some bedroom feeding a freaking huge bottle of milk to a cat girl. WHY ARE THEY FEEDING A HUGE BOTTLE OF MILK TO A CAT GIRL?! WHY DO THEY HAVE A CAT GIRL IN THEIR ROOM?! ARE THEY FRIENDS? ARE THEY KEEPING HER AS THEIR SLAVE?! THIS VIDEO BRINGS UP SO MANY QUESTIONS! THE MAIN ONE BEING WHAT THE HELL IS GOING ON HERE?! ALSO, WHAT IS UP WITH THE MUSIC IN THIS VIDEO? I THINK THAT WHOEVER MADE THIS VIDEO WAS TRYING TO MAKE THE SONG SOUND KINDA CHARMING OR ADORABLE, BUT TO ME IT JUST SOUNDS REALLY CREEPY, LIKE IT BELONGS IN AN OLD NINTENDO 64 GAME. By the way, what the hell is up with her ear here? I know it's nitpicking and all, but what the hell is up with it? It just kind of bugs me. Looks like she has some sort of parasitic worm that has weaved itself into her ear. I don't know. Anyway. Okay, I swear to God that these two girls drugged this cat girl, and that's why she has this creepy look on her face. Yet, with that in mind, that kind of makes this video a little dark and creepy. Especially with the background music and the fact that the two girls here look so happy at the end. It just makes it even creepier. Yeah. Let's move on. Okay, let's see what we have here. Hopefully it's not as bad as that last one we just saw. Good god. Okay, so we have Hatsune Miku blinking and doing what the... Oh dear god, they're playing Nyan Cat! Oh dear god, come on, this can't get any... Uh, um... What is she doing? Please, for God's sakes, tell me that she's just bouncing on some sort of chair or something. Because this, this is just really weird and really freaking awkward. Just made awkward by someone spying on her. And now he's being uh, yelled at, scolded by the mini demons that we just saw earlier. Wait a minute, that's a nipple guy from Pulpipo. It is. Oh my God! What the? I just, oh my God, uh, why is she, she was, uh, the slime from Dragon Quest, why? She's not even wearing any pants, oh my god, they zoomed in on that, come on, no, why, 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 no, no, why, no, no, why, oh come on, even someone new is spying in on her, and hello, possibly the best thing, hello, hello, number three, hello, Hatsune Miku does not approve, I don't approve at all. Why can't my hair be pink? I want to be more like her. I want pink hair. And then she goes back at it. Come on. She's really happy through this. And then some new people walk in and she doesn't even stop. She's still going strong at it at this point. This girl approves. This person's neutral. I don't know who that is. And then she starts... Grinding the pole! Well, she put pants on for this decency, I guess. Wow, that orange thing is getting a good view, huh? <laughs> They're being scolded and wide. Oh my god, those things just stared at me and. Wait, what? 
Mini Demon Basketball! And then a flying G! G oh dear god, no, they couldn't. He couldn't mean- oh my god. Oh my god, my reaction is the same as that disembodied squid head or whatever the hell it was. Oh my god, she just wrote something in blood! In blood, did she just die? Oh my god! That would probably be like the second greatest part of this video. Please have her be dead! Please have her be dead! This was the worst thing that anyone could have made! What? Why? Oh god, just... Why? I don't even know what to say to this one, to be honest. This is just perverted. Really, really perverted. You have a possibly underage girl who was wearing barely enough clothing for this not to be a porno, riding bare ass up and down on the pointed end of a slime monster from the Dragon Quest series. And I do mean that in the sexual way, sadly. As two people are caught peeping on her as she goes to town, <laughs> where they are then scolded by four chibi versions of the girl. Oh god, give me a minute. <laughs> Ugh. Sorry, after saying that, it all came back to me at once, and it made me feel incredibly dirty. <sighs> oh my god. This video is just so much wrong that I'm just going to sum it up as fast as I can. This video is full of almost porn-level material, shameful-slash-confusing images, and a totally annoying song with some actually pretty good animation that just makes you feel really dirty. Oh, thank god we only have one more to go. We're almost done! Let's just see what it is. Okay, hello? Why does she have a mustache? Okay, she's got a mustache too! What the chicken dance? Go, go, why do they are flying? Why are they in skates? Chicken dance, what? What is a green thing back there? And the Eiffel Tower just jet out of the sand? Okay, Cactar doing that dance is pretty nice and is- Wait a minute, is that War Greymon in the background? What is he doing there? Cactar everywhere! Why is Chibi Demon thing back there? What? Okay, they're squat walking. They must have terrible shits. Uh, why is she being stalked by a statue with a box underneath it? Wait, did you just summon a demon? I don't even... What? Okay, wait, what the hell was the... Wait a minute, I, I swear to god, I seen that thing back there in the... in Mario. What is going on? Okay, what the... Oh my god! Something normal in here! Well, semi-normal. I don't know why Amaterasu from Okami is here. But... I kinda like this one. Gentle. Well done. And short, then we go straight back to the cracked out mustache girls. And thus they go into the cactar everywhere, Eiffel Tower jetting out of nowhere. There goes War Greymon, why is he here? What is going on in the big screen back there? Cactar everywhere. King Slime in the bus back there, what the hell? What is going on here? Okay, all I'm seeing is why are they breakdancing? They shouldn't do that. Why? Cats? What? No, you're not! What the hell is going on up there? Where the hell did she pull that thing from? Why do you have mustaches? Why do you... Okay, we go back to this, but less understandably good. What the hell is that? What the... Whoa, okay, where is he coming? Why is he coming out of the star? Why is the... I don't know, and then he's eaten. Why, mustache girls? Wait, what the hell were those things? What is that? Why is there a pyramid back there? And ca Cactar, why? Why are they dancing Cactar again? Wh what is with the chibi demon things there? Cactar, green thing, what? What is going on? I don't... Mustache Girls, what is going on? I don't know! And then they all rise out of the... Wait, what the hell? Airman? What the hell is Airman from Mega Man doing here? The chibi things that... Wait, whoa, 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 what? Oh my god, I just saw Solid Snake! The hell is Solid Snake doing in here? No, get out of here! 
You, you won't be able to recover from this, no! What is Giant Bass coming out of the sand? What is going sell from Dragon Ball Z? What? And then Kingdom Hearts person and Jackie Chan, I guess. What? Why? Why is this going on? Why does this happen? I don't know. And Mexican... Mex Mexican mustache girls. I don't know. Why? No! That was painful! Oh, God. I thought that first video was painful, but... God! There was so much going on in this video, I have absolutely no idea what was actually going on in this video. This is actually a fan-made music video for the song Carlito by The Zippers or Zippers, whichever you want to go by. Granted, the actual animation for this is by far the best I have seen from the fan-made videos in this episode. The choreography is pretty good with some hiccups here and there, and there are a lot of different characters in it too. Yet therein lies the problem. There are way too many characters in this video! Almost every one of them is doing their own thing, which can sometimes lead to confusion and headaches. I'm actually rather surprised at who they put into this video, like Airman from Mega Man, War Greymon from Digimon, and even freaking Snake from Metal Gear. I was half expecting to see Charizard fighting the War Greymon that was driving around in the Doom buggy, and just the thought of that being in this would make it so much more awesome. At least it would counteract some of the what the fuckery in here. I mean, like, why the fuck are buildings rising out of the sand like they were in fucking Tartarus from the Sinbad movie? Why the hell is Snake in this video? Where the hell did she pull this thing from? Why do the girls have mustaches? Why the hell is Snake in this? What the fuck is that, 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 and that? And why the hell is Snake in this? Well, anyway. This video was weird as hell, confusing as hell, and so full of what the fuckery that you could watch the freaking shrooms moment from the Beavis and Butthead movie and have that make sense. But I really enjoyed this. No joke. This is actually a really good video where you can tell whoever made this put a lot of effort into making it. I actually recommend watching this without my commentary on it and just watch it. This this is actually really good. All in all, what do I have to say about the videos I saw? Well, the only thing coming to mind is OW! OW! PAIN! Why? Oh, and OW! Gah! How could she be a part of any of this pain? God, this bitch needs to die! <laughs> Thank you! Oh, thank God I'm finally done with this group of videos. But I know that there are a bunch more what-the-fuck videos on YouTube. And something tells me I might be watching every single one of them. Ugh. Anyway, if you have a video you guys wish for me to take a look at for the series, send me a link and I'll take a look at it. But until next time, guys, I am your host... Big Man X. Take care.